Good morning guys, we're here at the sea turtle rescue. It is 2 in the morning and we just have our shift to look after the sea turtles and we yeah we're gonna look for little raccoons and make sure they don't eat any of the eggs and just look to see if there's any babies that are gonna be born. So yeah, we're just gonna head off to our shift now. Alright guys, I'm on the lookout for some baby turtles and there was only one that's been hatched. He's all alone. So I think I'm gonna take him out to the sea. Are you ready to come with me? Are you ready? He can hear the ocean. <laughs> we hit the jackpot. So many babies just hatched. So much fun putting them out. Yay! So Jess is just keeping log of how many we found. 45. 45. <laughs> planning on doing some night photography but it's just too cloudy tonight and I'm surprised no turtles came and laid any eggs near us because usually they prefer the um I usually they prefer when it's really dark but it's been pretty uneventful we did release 70 babies which is cool but not like last night where we had raccoons babies being born releasing babies so uh we're pretty much just gonna head back up now shift over done. see you guys at breakfast gonna go have a two hour nap before breakfast this is I don't think this is ever not going to be weird when we start the vlog and we've already started it in the morning but um, yeah it's pretty much 8 o'clock and we're just heading in for a quick breakfast before we start work and I think today's jobs is going to be creating the new hatchery so it's going to be rewarding but very hard labour so we'll see how the day goes. Um, Jess ran ahead and got some breakfast already so I'll, I'll pass it on to her now. Yeah, as you've probably seen from the last few days, there are only two hatcheries. So, uno and dos. And then they're trying to build a third one to the right because these two are full and once the um, eggs have been laid in there, they don't reuse the sand. Not 100% sure why the eggs just don't grow as well. So they need to build a third one to accept some more eggs because at the moment they're not accepting any more eggs. So it's unfortunate when we see like a turtle for example, this one, which was laid right in front of us, and it's so sad to see that the eggs got eaten by raccoons last night. I mean, it was heart-wrenching, because we saw the eggs being laid, and then we came later on in the day, and they were gone. So, they're trying to fix the problem by building another hatchery so they can accept more eggs, um, and then vice versa, they'll empty out that one, and then they'll put fresh sand in there, and then they'll accept more eggs, and then they'll empty that one, and then it's a constant cycle. But I think they're down here somewhere. Oh yeah, I see them. Hey. As you can see, we're pretty much just sifting through the sand. So we have to dig up the old sand, sift through it to get finer grains. So that's better for the eggs. Um, but it is a big job. I haven't worked this hard in terms of labor for a while. I'm gonna show you guys something really cool. You ready? So I'm very sweaty because we just finished our job, but this is a little plant. Wait for it to focus. Okie dokie. <laughs> I've never seen it before, so you touch it, Stephen, and it wilts. You look yeah. really tired. <laughs> that was the toughest thing we've done. <laughs> it's lunch time, it's lunch time, and I'm hungry. <laughs> I'm starving. After like doing such strenuous work, you get so hungry. So um, we just got back and had a shower because we sweated up a storm. And now we're gonna go and eat some lunch, and then we're gonna go and hopefully the internet's working so we can put some videos up for you guys because the internet's very on and off here, so that's why these videos are a bit late. But we're trying, we're trying. It's lunchtime, it's lunchtime. It's lunchtime, it's lunchtime. It's lunchtime. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Alrighty guys, it's our turn to check if there's any turtles hatching. We currently just had lunch and I think I'm a little bit sunburnt. Also, it's Costa Rican Independence Day today. So if you're from Costa Rica, happy Independence Day. And Pula Vida. Pura Vida. Pula, Pula Vida. I can't roll my R, say it. Pura Vida. Hey. <laughs> Any babies? No 
show babies. Aww. Back to work, back to reality. Oh, it's so hot, I'm sweating already. What? Hi, there's a bit of white stuff on it. What? No. Uh -huh. I keep getting sunburn on my nose, so I've gone all out with the sunscreen this afternoon. But um, we just did some work, had a mini siesta, which resulted in me jumping in my sleep. <laughs> Stephen was like, what the hell? I was just like, Ugh. Anyway, <laughs> we're now heading down to do our afternoon chores. And then we'll probably go back to a little bit of work and then have a bit of another siesta because we've got to work at night. We have 11. to work at 11 till 2 tonight, looking after the bambinos. And tonight we get to go patrol the turtles, which I'm excited because we haven't done that yet. And I hope we can find a lot of mump turtles laying their eggs. It's really cool to see. So I think this will not get sunburned no longer. Got the 11 till 2 patrol tonight. Dee -dee 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 -dee. Should we go? We're going to do some actual patrolling to see if there's any um, turtles that are laying eggs. Alright, so this afternoon's task is we've continued with the third hatchery. Luckily it's a little bit cooler, so we're not going to get a sunburn from this morning. But uh, yeah, it's got to get done. It looks so weird, Steve, when I zoomed in right on your face. <laughs> it just looks like you're doing something weird. <laughs> that was funny. Hi ho, hi ho. about a hundred turtles but it's so frustrating because there's pelicans who are the turtles predator and they're just coming just like just picking them off slowly so frustrating. and there's nothing we can do because it's just nature Sunset, uh, we're just heading in for dinner, but it was awesome to send the sea turtles away. But also, so annoying that the pelicans were just there. And I know it's natural order, like they've got to eat as well, but when you've like looked after them and set them free and then to see them picked off, it's, it's depressing. But uh, yeah, we're just gonna head into dinner now. All right, so we're off to do our night shift. We're just gonna go patrol the beach and look to see if there's any turtles playing some eggs. Mm -hmm. We've got 11 till 2 today, so we've just had a little nap. And then we'll have our big sleep afterwards. <laughs> you look like Ace Odyssey. Oh my god, I'm Mars. I've All been right. in the dark too long. Can you see me, everyone? Um, we've just been patrolling the beach, and what we were doing was looking for turtles. We were then, if we found a turtle, measuring how wide it was and how long it was, and then we're also giving it a little clip with a little number so then we can track the turtles. So when they come back, we can see how many times they come back. And on, when we got to the end of the beach, we turned around, came back, and unfortunately that turtle's nest was robbed by raccoons. So annoying. But the hatcheries are full, so we can't take the eggs at the moment. And as you saw today, oh, as you saw yesterday, so, oh, today. But as you saw today, we are building a new hatchery, and once that's built, we can start collecting eggs again. But for the moment, we have to try our hardest to try and make sure they don't get stolen by poachers. If they get eaten by raccoons, it's better than being stolen by poachers, you know? You know, cool nature. story, bro. Nature. Oh. All right, guys. Good night. This is weird. Not ending at, at five in the morning. Oh wait. Yeah, it is yeah. two in the morning, but we'll just put it in today's vlog. But um, good night, guys, and we'll see you in the morning. Bye. Bye.